afternoon, Dr. Deborah, all teachers and fellow students. Today, I, I am Yong Kai from Year 3. Today, I'm going to tell you a story about the stone cutter. Once there was a stone cutter. He was a simple man who enjoyed his work. Every day he cut stone from the Grand Mountain. In the mountain there lived a spirit. He was a good spirit who helped people. One day, the stone cutter took some stone to a rich man's house. Upon seeing these fine things in the large house, he said, Oh, I wish I got these fine things like these. And a magical voice said, You shall have what you wish. It was the voice of the mountain spirit. He searched high and low but could not find who had spoken these words. One hot summer day, the stone cutter saw a prince ride back in a carriage. The prince had many servants. One of them is using a golden parasol to shake the prince from the sun. The stone cutter was troubled by heat. I wish to be a prince and have a servant holding a parasol over my head. He pouted. The spirit heard his wish and replied, You shall have what you wish. At the moment, the stone cutter's house became a large palace. And a servant with a golden parasol appeared. But the stone cutter was still hot and unhappy. The heat from the sun is the most powerful thing, he said. I wish to be the sun. You shall have what you wish, said the spirit. The stone cutter got his wish. He found himself high in the sky. He had become the sun. He burned trees, grass, and people's faces. The stone cutter was happy, but then a gray ring cloud came to rest in front of him, shading everything below. The cloud is much stronger than the sun, he said. I wish to be the cloud. The stone cutter became a mean, angry cloud. He rained so hard that he flooded the villages and the rice fields. Only the large mountain remained unharmed. When the stone cutter saw this, he said, The 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 mountain is much stronger than the cloud. I wish to be the great mountain. Now I'm the most powerful, he said, as he became the mountain. But the next day, 
Another storm cutter came. He took out his hammer and started hitting the rock. I see now it is the man who is most powerful. I wish to be a man again, he said. One last time, said the spirit, you shall have what you wish. The stone cutter became a man again. He realized he had been foolish. He cut stones and lived in his little house again. He lived happily being a man forever. The end.